surely one of the most remarkable animals that has ever existed, and certainly one of the most famous, is a dinosaur, like Tyrannosaurus Rex. This creature was one of the documentary series Prehistoric Planet. What kind of animal was it? How do they look like? And how do they coexist in our modern world? Well, scientific research and several theories has answered these questions all over the T-Rex or any other dinosaur, but other species of wildlife that live alongside it. With the latest green screen technology or visual effects enables us to bring them all back to life on this series. Planet Tug, 66 million years later. The skies were ruled by flying reptiles and tears to a And in the seas, monstrous reptiles patrol the depths. And on land, dinosaurs of every kind making a struggle for our human survival. And now we know so much about the world and the world by the dinosaurs. And this is Dinosaurs in the Modern Day, the theory. to a place called Dolores Warren and this place is this episode is set in England in Devon a variety of dinosaurs live here from the majestic stegosaurs to the flying tyrannosaurs and even sea creatures like mosasaurs and plesiosaurs live during the sea, but the focus of this episode are the Ceratopsian dinosaurs. Not Nasitoceratops, but both different species of dinosaurs. It is a time. At this time, dinosaurs should have won, but the focus of this episode is one of the species of all time. Triceratops, meaning three horned face. Here we have a family herd of different kinds of family, but one is special. This Triceratops calf is named Tang. It's named after Tang because he has a bony frill on his head to protect the bodies when Rick fighting. Until this evening got interrupted by a large predatory dinosaur called Acrocanthosaurus. Since hence the predator was here, the herd decided to move on. Until they realized something and they've forgotten one of their babies. So the animal has run out of breath, but the herd continues to move on, which leaves the mother very, very furious. So the carnivore has won its territory. And the next day, 
an animal decides to go off to Taurus Warren into Taurus, which is another spot in England. So you follow footprints and then see an opportunity to, to find his mother by telling his own geek what happened. But that one and believe him. And one out of opportunities, so it is decided to go into the grasslands and try his book very best to find his mother. We're blending in into camouflage because usually young dinosaurs like triceratops would normally only hide themselves from predators like T Rex or even Dromaeosaurus. And fables. So, when a while tank was out in the corn, they heard of a Pasaurus decides to look for him. And his mother was dead the whole time in corn. The dinosaurs and intended for her son away from danger. Looking for his mother, a giant predatory dinosaur called Gigantosaurus comes in out of nowhere and wants to fight an Acro Camphosaurus. So, a Tyrannosaurus Rex comes in to the scene and fights the Giga. When the giant carnivores were continuing to fight, Right Tank decides to run away from the hunter before he gets hunted. After looking for a son for a few days, she has reunited with her calf in safety of her horns. A little trick, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. With the reunion in place, they have decided to go back with and she promised the cat never to abandon him ever again. 
During the great struggle of life of Triceratops Moradas. Plus, I give a huge, huge shout out to Thomas Traxon Creations for letting me using this beautiful song. time on Dinosaurs in the Modern Day The Series, we'll be dis discussing about the sea monsters of our world's Asians, following sharks, plesiosaurs, and the most ferocious monsters of the sea, Mosasaurus, with a first episode called Sea Monsters. <laughs> 